The mission of Code Korean Steakhouse is to bring people together through food. Good dinner brings the entire family or entire group of friends together. And I love that. I love that experience. My name is Simon Kim, owner of Code Korean Steakhouse. My name is David Shim, executive chef of Code Korean Steakhouse. Code is the first of its kind, the fun and fire of Korean barbecue, married with American Steakhouse, where beef is king. We focus on the quality of the steak and the authenticity of Korean cuisine. When we created Code Korean Steakhouse, we said, you don't have to choose, you can have it all. And that's what Butcher's Feast is about, right? Yeah, so our Butcher's Feast consists of four different cuts. USDA prime hanger steak, which is wet aged. 45 day aged ribeye, which is dry aged in-house. By dry aging, we naturally brings out its umami. We also offer American Wagyu coach steak, which is the best of both worlds. Japanese beef, super buttery, then American Black Angus, which is beefy and very flavorful. We finish it with our signature dish, which is a diamond cut, USDA Prime marinated short rib kalbi. This is like a meat candy, and it's a perfect way to finish the meal. So you have a bunch of amazing steak, but it's served with a bunch of vegetables. Pickled vegetables that's rich in fiber, rich in probiotics, so you can have a awesome steak dinner that's really healthy for you. Let's get started by cooking our first cut, which is a hanger steak. And this is our uh, gastronome salt. We want to make sure we salt liberally. Included in the kit, we have our coat salt blend. It's actually a blend of three different salts. Thousand day aged Korean sea salt, Himalayan salt, and we have Maldon salt. Included in the kit, there is a small piece of grease. Instead of using oil, we're going to be greasing the pan with the fat. This will definitely bring another layer of flavor. All right, let's put the hanger right. steak onto the pan. And we can start cooking the ribeye as well so that we can have all the steaks resting. Sounds like a plan. It has always been my dream to open a Korean steakhouse. Growing up in Korea, barbecue restaurants, that was my favorite. So I came to America when I was 13 years old. I didn't know how to speak English at all. I was a busboy when I was 16 years old at my mother's restaurant. You know, I fell in love with the restaurant industry. I worked for amazing chefs like Jean Georges and Chef Thomas Keller. Learned a lot about fine dining. And here we are. I'm sharing my culture, my love for beef, my love for my cuisine with our guests. And now being able to do this with the entire country is a dream come true. All right. The ribeye's been sitting for about a minute and a half. I'm gonna give it a flip. Oh my goodness, mm. look at that. We can also get the coat steak on. Oh, the coat steak. And Chef, where should I put this? We can go right. Mm. This cut is American Wagyu. It's gonna be one of the most buttery steaks that you can get. All right, last but not least, we're gonna cook the wow. marinated short rib kalbi. It's a beautiful diamond cut. And the scoring allows the marinade to really permeate into the meat. Wow, look at this one. It's like perfect. This butcher's face is perfect when you have a bunch of people over, right? You have four different cuts of meat, four different vegetables. Your mom likes the ribeye, your dad likes the hanger steak. It's really fun and communal experience. All right, then let's dig in. Let's right. make some rubs. And I'm gonna go for cooked steak. Boom, a little bit of samjang. I like cucumber, <laughs> some cucumber. I like radish as well. And then I'm gonna go and wrap this up. Even though it's something that I like, I give oh, it to no. my chef. Ah. Uh, what do you think, chef? In Korean culture, there's nothing that says, I love you more <laughs> than a little yeah. uh, lettuce wrap filled with steak. So when you order our feast through Gold Belly, we want to share our passion with you. You can just have it your way. Mm. Mm.